Well, but first, city officials have meetings planned next week to let folks know about the next round of street construction. Uh, one of the project is on Everhart between Holly and SBID. Chris 6 News reporter Greg Chandler is live near the intersection of Everhart and Corona with more on that. Greg. Lee, commuters on Everhart have already been dealing with delays because of the construction going on at the Corona intersection. Well, sometime next year, it's Everhart itself that's going to be torn up, and people I spoke with are cautiously optimistic. I think it's a road that's uh, in desperate need of revising. It needs to be updated. Jesse Mendoza has owned Comics Plus on Everhart near SPID for four years. He says traffic backups make it difficult for customers to get to his shop. There's a lot of traffic congestion on it, and at times it makes it extremely hard to get in and out of the shopping center. Mendoza's comic shop is about to get some relief. Next year, Everhart will be rebuilt between Holly and SPID. But before the road can be rebuilt, city officials want the public's opinion. We're not ready to go into the construction phase quite yet, and so we really want that feedback from the public, um, kind of things that maybe they have issues with when they're traveling that street. Mendoza says he's seen plenty of problems for drivers on Everhart. And those problems affect his business. Sometimes I have people that come in that um, may not have trouble getting to our store, but then when it comes to leaving, it, it's hard with all the backed up traffic. He's also concerned about the Everhart project overlapping with the nearby Corona construction project. With both of them going on, it would really diminish our traffic flow. We need access from somewhere, and if at least we had Corona already done, and people able to access us through that side, it would be much better. Now the city has good news for Mendoza. Officials tell me that the Corona construction project will be finished before the Everhart project starts. So when will the Everhart project start? All city officials can tell me is sometime in 2019. Lee. All right, Greg, thank you very much for that report. Now, plans are also in the works to reconstruct Holly Road from Rodfield to Ennis Jocelyn Road near Atkins Middle School, and then Slough Road from Rodfield Road to Amethyst Street near Colda Elementary. The city will be hosting again three public meetings to go over the plans and discuss what kind of changes to expect. If you're interested in attending, we have more information on those meetings posted for you on ChrisTV.com.